hey guys welcome to today's episode this is going to be kind of a short video but yesterday i watched another video from a big youtuber called hanza and i thought i might share the same thing with you in case you haven't seen the video because it wasn't on his main channel and the idea is pretty interesting and for those of you who are males uh, it's going to be really important and useful so let's go basically his main idea is he got that idea from a book from tim ferris uh, which is called the four hour body and in this book basically uh the author uh, is struggling with his quality of his sperm and the amount of sperm he has and basically he realized that one of the main problems is if you keep your phone next to your balls, basically in your pocket of your jeans. So what I'm trying to tell you is that you should definitely not hold your phone there and you should stop holding it there because it's affecting in a worse way your sperm and your future kids, you might say. So that's why you could get a handband where you could hold your phone or just hold it in your jacket's pocket or hold it in your hand or in your back but don't hold it in your jeans next to your bows because the phone sends signals which are unhealthy for your bows and sperm another thing about a diet now this is not from his video this is something i want to share with you too because uh, it's kind of the same topic living healthy and now i know some of you might be on a diet which is perfect but some of you are also eating mcdonald's every single day and consuming way more calories than they need and they're not trying to bulk and i mean do a healthy bulk they just eat it because they don't have any self-control so i'm not gonna give you a diet because some diets are even unhealthy I'll tell you what kinds of food you should strive to eat every single day and which types of food you should definitely avoid if you want to live healthy. Now, if you're really obsessed with the gym and with the fitness, I'm sure you're probably counting your calories. But another thing you could do is you could just try to eat, if you're trying to bulk, for example, you could try to eat as much stuff which is healthy for example, meat, rice, potatoes, and that kind of stuff. And you should definitely avoid chocolate or sugar or these energy drinks. That way you get inside your body the required calories. But they won't be from energy drinks. They, won't be, they will be from something that's healthy and which your body could digest easily and won't hurt your stomach or other parts of your body so you should definitely eat a lot of protein now i wouldn't recommend for you to eat bread but a good replacement would be potatoes or rice you should a hundred percent eat vegetables and fruits for example if you're used to eating snacks chips or doritos which is kind of a chips but anyway you could eat a carrot or you could eat strawberries like something that's healthy which is also tasty it doesn't like it's not something that tastes like rubber gum and which will even improve your system and it will satisfy your hunger the things you should avoid are pretty much all the fried stuff like chips like the chicken from mcdonald's you should also avoid sugar now some of you are used to drinking coffee in the morning for example and to be honest in the future i might make a video especially for this topic but today i'll cover this topic pretty briefly and it is that the caffeine isn't as unhealthy as like all the fried food but there are some researches that show that it's better if you don't put caffeine in your body or that much caffeine in your body because your body gets used to it and after that requires even more and more and if you for example drink coffee four hours before you go to bed it's way harder for you to go to sleep and your sleep isn't of that high of a quality as it could have been so that's another thing you should 
keep in mind. And the last thing is that the diet you will be is entirely up to you. You can create it so it's healthy, it's useful, it's good for your body, but you also enjoy what you're eating and when you're eating it. So this is going to be for today's episode. I told you it wasn't going to be a long one, but I had to share with you that idea that I got from Hamza and then talk about a diet because I've been meaning to create such a video and I thought to myself, well, I might as well just combine the two of them. So as I already said, this is going to be for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching or listening and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.